Hi, this is John Price at ECD, and today we're going to list the top five vintage style defenders that we have built. We have Project JP, a 110 hardtop painted in Keswick green and white. Um, again, very traditional combination and uh, color wise, also has a uh, very rich um, interior leather in distress uh, brown that again sets it apart from a conventional interior and gives it a little bit more of that vintage feel and look. And then at number four comes Project C Square. Uh, very simple, very elegant looking um, Defender 110 soft top in marine blue, which is absolutely gorgeous. Very traditional interior with the classic dash, tan color leather, um, again, all wrapped up in a very subtle, simple uh, type of build very classic but as well stunning looking car and number three comes project dm absolutely beautiful caledonian blue defender 110 um, decline went to the extent of adding serious 2a style side fenders to make it look a little bit more heritage yet retaining all of the elements inside from a more modern defender the two-tone white and blue um, paint color it looks amazing and also combines a silver metal mesh grille in the front with an oval Land Rover emblem a very old-school um, touch in there which just makes it look phenomenal at number two comes project Tembo this is a beautiful Defender 90 soft top that we built for our client in Keswick green uh, very simple very subtle uh, silver accents all around um, color matching wheels. It just looks absolutely beautiful. Uh, very understated, but just very classic looking Defender 90. Number one is uh, probably one of my favorite builds ever. It's Project Santa Cruz. This one has a very unique two-tone chalk and white and grassmere green color combination that looks outstanding. It looks very vintagey, uh, more like a 1980s or even a 1970s series truck. Uh, however, it does have all the modern conveniences, of course. Beautiful layout, inside out. It looks just stunning. Yeah, so these are our top five vintage style defenders that we built. Uh, of course, if you have any questions or would like to find out how to build your own, please uh, give us a call, reach out, and um, you know where to find us.